There's truly nine steps to do a proper two-step solvent cemented joint. Step number one is to cut the pipe square. The second step in the process, we recommend that you bevel and deburr the outside wall of the pipe. Step number three, we want you to clean the pipe end. All job sites are contaminated with oil, debris, moisture, so give it a quick wipe. Step number four, we want you to do a dry depth insertion of the pipe into the fitting, approximately one to two thirds insertion. The next step after the dry fit is your application or your scrubbing of the solvent. It's very important that you work the solvent aggressively into the fitting. Six revolutions will be enough, and it's always on the fitting first, on the pipe, back on the fitting. Number six is your cement. The rotation for cement application is pipe, then fitting back on pipe. Number seven, insert the pipe fully into the socket of the fitting, give it a one eighth to quarter turn, that'll even up the cement distribution, and then hold it. About 30 seconds is adequate. When this product is prepared as recommended, it has a tendency to want to push apart. Number eight, go back to that rag and carefully wipe the excessive cement from outside the bonding area. Don't forget to leave a nice heavy roll bead between the pipe and the fitting so the inspector can see you've done it right. And number nine, let the joint fully set and cure. Check our installation guide. It'll define how long you must wait before you fire that appliance so it doesn't affect the integrity of the joint.